Okay, here's my new aeroponic bucket. Um, I just planted this plant about three, four days ago. Today is July 15th, 2009. Uh, I got the uh, instructions and the idea from another guy on YouTube, uh, Cywire. And the uh, plant seems to be doing pretty good. I've been keeping it in the shade until it gets a lot of roots. But, uh, works pretty good. I mean, the, uh, the sprinklers are spraying on it. I don't, I don't know how well the plant's going to grow. Growing here, but we'll see. I'm only using uh, two gallons of water in this bucket, so one of the advantages of the system is less. Uh, I'm getting one little root on there already. About five days. So it's going pretty good. I'll keep uh, I'll keep you updated on this one. I'll show you my other hydros. This is my jalapeno. It's doing real well. Starting to get flowers on this one. And then here's the. Uh, this is the uh, general hydroponic water farm. So far, I don't see too much difference between the the water, the top drip water farm, and the uh, the bubble ponic or deep water culture. Um, they both look like they're about the same same uh, growth rate. I just changed the nutrients today. Um, the thing I don't like about this one, the, the water farm is uh, the water uh, evaporates out of the system too fast. I was constantly uh, filling it up with water. You know, I'm growing outdoors, so I don't know if that's one of the problems. I mean, it's super hot here right now. And uh, it's been in the, the high 90s, low 100s the last few days. Well, kind of surprising the plants are doing this good, you know, 100 degree day and it hasn't killed them. Yeah, I guess they're in water, yeah. This one's doing good. This one's got a lot of roots now. Mucho roots, man. the roots in this one. Got some roots in that one. Keep you updated on the, the aeroponic one.